All right. Guten Morgen. Alles klar. Guten Morgen. Oh, du kannst Deutsch? <laughs> no, that's as much as you're going to get. <laughs> so I'm here at, um, at the Zoe Convention in, in Salzburg. It's uh, called in German um, Stromspiele. Mm -hmm. So, and I have a special guest here. I have Jan Bart and Craig yeah. from the island, I would say. The islands. The islands. The islands. Yes. So, Craig is from, from England and uh, Jan Bart is from... Oh, well, I'm from... Ireland. I, I live in Ireland. You I'm not live from in Ireland. Ireland. Ah, okay. I'm from Holland. Hello? You're Hence from the name. Yeah, that's that's the point yeah. why you're traveling to to Holland so often. Yes, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. All right. So, what was what is the main purpose of traveling here? So, well, it's to meet up with your lovely folks, um, but also we have some sponsorship. We want to raise some money for uh, Might and Hospice. Yep. Where, um, which is where my mother was uh, before she passed away seven years ago and just something giving back so we've uh, decided to do 1400 kilometers to austria from the uk yeah yeah non-stop non-stop yeah this is this is what i saw i, I was amazed in in, in glimpse when i see oh they're traveling they're traveling yeah. and, and they're, they're still traveling, traveling and still traveling. Yeah. when did they stop were you watching <laughs> continuously <laughs> not really no did you see our little detour around 1 30 in the morning no that was I no Oh, that's 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 good. Go that's good. We'll we'll actually keep that a secret for a little later. <laughs> okay. But we took a slight bit of a detour around 1:30 in the morning, and it definitely was not nice. <laughs> All right. But you'll see that uh, you'll see that later. Yeah. We'll we'll have another uh, video. We'll probably stick that in the description of this one. Ah, but right. in another few weeks, we'll have to uh, it'll probably it'll probably take me about a week to get this all together. Yeah. But I, but I saw in the plan it was another route. You yes. Know. Okay. So the the, the the original plan was to go through France, but on um, Monday evening which was sort of two days before we were going I was looking at the route and I was just there thinking there's actually too high a chance of problems yeah. because France there's still a lot of type yeah. 3 charges yeah, and we don't right. have a type 3 cable yeah. so if something weren't to go wrong actually there wouldn't be a backup yeah. so I went the day before I arrived, I just went a brief tour and I just said to Craig, I think it's easier to go through Belgium, Holland and yeah, Germany. Yeah. It was only about, probably about 40 kilometers longer, mm -hmm. but there was less of a chance of failure. And that was true, because it was a fairly yeah. smooth journey. It was up. very, very smooth. The biggest mm -hmm. problem was staying awake. Yeah, yeah. This, this, this I can imagine, yeah. Yeah, so yeah. We, we took turns and someone would be sleeping, whereas the other person would be driving. And then, of course, in, when we were charging, some, some of the time... Worked out about 200 miles per Yeah, each, roughly. Each person yeah, roughly. Every 200 miles. Yeah. And the, 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 the only pauses were charging? And Just charging. Yeah, and that's it. You're crazy. <laughs> <laughs> yes, we are. <laughs> we are great. But that's why we're doing it for charity, because yeah. you wouldn't actually do it normally. You just, yeah, you just right. wouldn't. Um, yeah. It's not that you can't do it, just most people yeah. just wouldn't. Yeah, um, right. So, yeah, and I mean, it's, it's a lovely day for it and and there's apparently over close to 150 electric cars and most of them are electric yes. Zoe's so that's perfect and we, that's uh, a 22 kilowatt yep this is a 22 yeah. kilowatt so the original one original two years old no that's not old. You, you you technically have the refresh oh yes the, the, you the, technically the, have the refresh i have an original you don't no. ah. <laughs> but it is the q210 yeah. so it's got q2. the wrap fast okay charge. all right uh -huh. 22 and uh yeah we had some interesting facts and figures as well the battery never got over 30 degrees right. and it was non-stop charging rapids yeah. every every we time. Had a, there was, every a, time. There was okay. a gentleman yeah. here um there's a gentleman here from hamburg he cl he traveled close to a thousand kilometers to get here in a nissan leaf and his battery got close to about 50 degrees yeah the the, the thing is with, with the leaf yeah, he has no, no cooling, cooling. So yeah that's, that's ridiculous yeah now yeah. in saying that if he had a 30 kilowatt hour leaf yeah. his battery would be boiling by now he yeah. it would actually it actually gets hotter this car had absolutely no problems yeah. none yeah. So it just goes to show, if you want, you can drive all the way to the UK. Oh, it's easy. And just to point out, if you're whilst you're in the UK, you can actually just drive to Ireland very easily as well. Because um, I, I, I'm a member of the Irish EV Owners Association, and we do um, we do um, a, a photographic rally in Ireland every year. So we <laughs> pick 32 po points in the, around the country, one in each county of Ireland, including Northern Ireland. And you take your electric car there, you take a picture. And uh, we last year we had somebody who did the whole rally, all 32 points, uh, in a Tesla Model S from Oslo. All right. He came all the way from Oslo. But it was not. It was not uh, Bjorn. No, it wasn't. <laughs> that, sadly not. Sadly, yeah. Sadly not. Although I have asked him, do you want to come to Ireland? So Bjorn, if you please. see this video, please, please, please do. We have Tesla superchargers. <laughs> yeah. One. By the time you're watching this, probably two. <laughs> And the rest is free, you know, Chatamo, so no shuku. <laughs>
<laughs> so how many soys are there already in Ireland? Not a lot. Um, probably uh, probably about 150. All right. Uh, electric cars are not very popular in Ireland. Mm -hmm. okay. um, it's one of the reasons I make the videos is just to show that you, you actually can own an electric car yeah. in Ireland. Um, so no, the, I think every year they probably only sell about 400. All right, yeah. It's, okay, that's that's. Really, it's disappointing. Really, it's very yeah. disappointing. It's it's a little bit like like in Germany we have let's say, okay, we have per quarter at the moment 12,000, no, not 1,200, mm -hmm. as always. But let's say. Um, when when we look at the, the whole number of, of cars, so it's it's ridiculous at the moment. It is, but it yeah. it, it it'll be there. Um, yeah. I think last year the total electric car sales in Ireland was 0.25 percent yeah. of all new registrations were electric. So it's that's 0. more than 25. in Germany. Yeah, <laughs> Germany we have. 0.15 last year or so. Okay. But okay, it's it's decreasing. So we have 50% more than last mm -hmm. year's quarter. Yeah. So it's 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 coming. In Ireland it went down. Yeah. Uh, okay. <laughs> Last year it went down compared right. to 2015. Okay. We also found out that uh, your the German network is quite poor because we yeah. were spotted en route yeah. and were on a German yeah. motoring oh, Facebook magazine site and they had actually called us quite crazy for doing this journey. Yeah, yeah we. Yeah. I, I guess we were fortunate. Yeah, we were very fortunate because they must have picked the right route because charges were reliable. So. But I'll be back. I'll be back. I'll take my car here sometime. Yeah, um, that I'm, will I'm, be great. I'm going back to Holland in August, okay. and I plan on doing a bit of a bit, a bit of a, a, a trip into Germany just for a few days. Um, you know, just I want to try and see. Um, I was in Munich okay. with my. This is in 2013 before I got an electric car, and I, I I'd love to go back. And now that I know that you can, I think I might. But not in one day. Not in one day. No, yeah, definitely not. <laughs> no. Would we do it again? <laughs> No. No. <laughs> <laughs> no. But it was well worth it for the challenge. Yeah, with an, and on the way back, just in case people are confused, we're not doing the same thing on the way back. We are actually spending an overnight somewhere okay, because right. like it's it's crazy to do it. Journey, yeah. It was it was probably there were certain points in the in sort of in the overnight in Germany where we just like I, it, this is this is getting ridiculous because we were both so tired. The hardest part was we were actually the day before the day we left. We were actually at work as well. I was at work, Jan wasn't. Yeah. Uh, Jan was traveling over to the UK. Yeah. So he came here, we had no sleep that day. Okay. Then yeah. we started the travel and we had like three to four hours in between. So within 48 hours, I think we had five hours sleep at the most. Yeah. So but uh, look, look him up online for the Renault Zoe Owners Club in the UK. RZOC, just Google. And, um, <laughs> you know, and uh, he was uh, kind enough to, uh, to allow me to come along with him on this trip. And it's been absolutely yep. awesome. Thank you all the sponsors as well. Yeah. Ecotricity, all Rolex. So do you know how many you have collected so far? We've done over, I think we're nearly up to £1,200 at the moment and still right. climbing. Um, and all the sponsors obviously paid for our channel tunnel the hotels uh -huh. we thank you to the austrian yeah. zoe club that has paid for us to, uh, yeah, to stay thank here you very as well. much to uh, alex amazing. and thomas uh -huh. they've been brilliant yeah so we, we've we've done this trip on a minimal so and uh, it's about 40 euros yeah roughly. i think we spent 40 euros in, in fuel in electric fuel, fuel yeah, yeah in, in fuel in power power yeah power. about 40 yeah. euros <laughs> travel here you wouldn't do that in a normal ice car yeah it would cost you that's 100, right. 200 euros <laughs> yeah, yeah. 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 It's, it's been a, it's been an experience. And it's been lovely meeting you. Yes. Yeah. It was a pleasure. <laughs> oh well, you know the day is still young, so. Yeah. Let's see. All right. So that was a short interview, and thank you for watching. Yes. Thank you for watching. Yeah. We'll see you around.